Today, I'd like to talk to you about the basics of the Christian life. We're going to be looking at words taken from Jesus' Sermon on the Mount. Ah, for many people are believers in Christ. These are very familiar words. They uh, sum up, if you will, some of the most basic things about the Christian life. Now, I'm Pastor Krause, Christ Lutheran Church, Pewaukee, Wisconsin, and I'm going to be reading to you words taken from Matthew chapter 5, verses 13 to 16. You are the salt of the earth, but if its salt loses its saltiness, how can it be made salty again? It is no longer good for anything except to be thrown out and trampled underfoot. You are the light of the world. A town built on a hill cannot be hidden. Neither do people light a lamp and put it under a bowl. Instead, they put it on its stand, and it gives light to everyone in the house. In the same way, let your light shine before others, that they may see your good deeds and glorify your Father in heaven. Here the Lord tells us two basic things. You are salt, and you are light. We're going to start with salt. Salt has been a most basic commodity for the world throughout all the generations. People already back in ancient times knew the value of salt. They knew the value of salt because it was a preservative. When salt was mixed in with different types of food, it would help that food to last. We think about... Uh, Two months salt, maybe, in some respects, when we open up a, a can of peas or who knows what, and we look at that sodium level, we look at that salt level, and we're like, wow, that's a lot of salt, or we taste its saltiness. You are to be salt. You are to be a preservative. This world's going to pot. There's no doubt about it. People talk about it all the time. And yet, you're different. You enhance the flavor of this world, when everyone is cursing and swearing and you don't curse and swear, let me tell you something, people notice. When people are telling dirty jokes and you walk away, let me tell you something, people notice. That's because you're living out your Christian life and whether you're conscious of this passage or not, you are salt. You enhance the flavor. You're a preservative in a decaying world. And you are light. You are light. Years ago, I went out to eat with my daughter, and we were up north someplace, and we had to walk well over a mile. And during the day, it was a very, you know, beautiful, dark road. It went through a, a forest of pines. And at night, I hadn't brought a flashlight or anything. I wasn't really thinking about it. But we started walking back to where we were staying. And let me tell you, it was pitch dark. You know, I, I thought my eyes would start to get used to the darkness and things would uh, be a little bit better that I could see shapes or I'd get an idea where the road was. But I'll tell you, it was so dark and those uh, pine trees so blocked out any light from stars or from the moon or whatever that we couldn't see anything. The only time I knew that I was off the way was when I'd get off the asphalt and start walking on gravel. I knew I was no longer on the way. Now, we take light for granted to a great degree unless we find ourselves in a situation like that. In ancient times, they didn't have street lamps out there. They didn't have flashlights, but they had oil lamps, a little, a little lamp with... Uh, a place you could put some olive oil, and then they would light a wick, and that little flame would give light. And isn't it true that little flame can make such a difference? You are to be light in a dark world, and this world is getting darker and darker. The things we uh, hear about, the things we see, the things that we read about, the attitudes of people— the way that people are just in our face and mean and ugly to us and to other people. Hmm? But you aren't to be like that. You are to be light, fueled by the good news of Jesus Christ, your Lord and Savior. 
This little gospel light of mine, I'm going to let it shine. This little gospel light of mine, I'm going to let it shine. Let it shine, let it shine all the time. God go with you.